Ah, hello, and welcome back to my number for vlog. For me, it's been a little while. Don't know about you. When V, I don't know when you get read my errors come on right while I'm watching them, or if they might all get really don't. But for me, it's been a while. Cause they were airing in the UK, where they airing a bunch right back. But up until this pairing, where they just aired in Spain, it's both very available in Spanish, but not in English. And we'll get until now, where I don't know. Like, I don't know. I guess the file I watched had clearly from taken from the Spanish Disney Channel or whatever. The audio was in English, go I assume that they just, over there they have the um you can watch up in English like you watch up fans over here. Yeah. Hey guys, come until now go and put it up. But anyway, it might be up for a while, I don't know. But either way, let's quickly get through the pairing. Um I think lots of videos we do about it. we have no idea what uh, past this point. Uh, but I'll talk about that at the end. Uh, anyway, anyway, so first up is Free Fall written by Joshua Pirouette. And Vic up code basically, basically the free falling. They are doing the free falling thing, like a free start from their machine, but the course, then the believe that got started, but, or they were, they were dying there. But either way, they ended up free falling through Danville and got a, Get our way down safely without, you know. And that thing was a lot of And, uh, I really liked the one. It's very, never one of them got because I felt kind of free and y where it just a couple times like, oh, free falling, and we're free falling happened. And I just feel, feel like we're going to be a boarding up because at this point where it's just the big practical show. But they end up being some of my favorites because it's like just a couple premise and go on with it. Just go many, like, jokes and a lot of funny things that they do. It's not a good game night. Nothing gonna tie that one, I think. For a while, I mean, but this game is still really good though. Uh, the good cameras get involved in a fun way. Um, story line, well, interesting thing, and cameras limiting the fact that no one can do what we do, because no one can get any good thing we do. But the eight government agent guy knows the stuff we do and our hounding them now, um, and he finds he's happy about that. Um, you know, the best thing about both of these, no doof, and no finny came in general. At the latter episode, they play the beak theme, which makes sense when I get to it. Um, but, um, outside of that, no look at reference, no doof. Holy crap. I can't remember what the episode was before the one. I feel like it was my Shadow Kick Day, which were very doof heavy. Go, oh, thank goodness. Ah. You know, um, over on that, my little podcast that to my friend Cav, they make a joke about how doof should basically be um, <laughs> and I, and, and I agree, uh, whenever do a truck on screen, everyone should be going, where do we <laughs> Uh, okay, it's not, it's fine, yeah, but anyway, I feel glad that they will take a break, and the current, no, actually, you know, I'll talk about that in the other episode, but yeah, we got, we got a couple of funny jokes, you know, I like the running gag about expiration date, and how it ha the all the stuff that you're doing happen to have that same expiration date, um, yeah, the other guy could have gone, got to realize, Good, I guess, going back to that great. Um, you know, so get to follow the fun gag with how they are. You know, you're going to get involved in a fun way. It definitely felt like we won in a good way. I don't know, I just feel like V could be the most boring episode, the one that feels just like we won again. But, well, I don't know, show did a good job of having multiple episodes be they do everything thing go wrong, but still keeping it entertaining and not just over seeing the game thing over again, even, you know. Um, I think we're going to do a good job of keeping that up, and it's quite entertaining. One flaw I have is, like, I point out a couple times in the account, because the animation looks a little, might be a bit weirdly enough a family guy, and the cloak of trying to talking, and the cup code is more prevalent, because the cup code, like, starts the cloak out shot of that free falling, and it looks bad. Like, it looks like flash animation, which, again, they when they back up, it's like, okay, I've worried about somebody in the cloak code, or, or they went the fairy out pants route. <laughs> but no, you just that one shot. And, I, and it can be our cocoa shot. You know it get looking slightly weaker. The animation a little more limited. And kind of characters like talk in a way of family guy. Yeah. But I know from a cocoa shot, when it, the normal animation, it looked pretty good and you will. But I don't know. That's been happening. But maybe it's been happening since day one. And I just haven't noticed it. Because they, maybe because I'm more attracted. Or just become made of, or maybe it's been that exact and they're just more prevalent looking, or they just got a guy, like, 
not a downgrade animation, even though generally don't like Wally to that when the glow cut shot, you know. But that first shot was zooming in looks bad though. I didn't know any a bunch of that check it up though, no. Yeah, free fall, very simple up good, but very entertaining line good joke. Yeah, go. And it gets slightly interesting story stuff which go cabinet, go. There you go. Um I was gonna say so it's good. Really <laughs> um, anyway, um, thank you for that one. Uh, now on to the other one, My Little Girl, written by Joshua up here at, I hope it's pronounced it right, but anyway, well, uh, apparently the fifth one, that Neil from the comic shop appeared, um, <laughs> we'll get to him in a second. He appeared, again, he wanted to kind of My Little Go Through Life, and basically we got a bunch of characters sharing a story about how they feel he get through life, or what they think would deal with Murphy Law, Murphy Law, and like Bradley thinking he could be a super villain doing that big thing on purpose just to fix them <laughs> and look good, for example. And in that form, they play a big theme, even though that's a superhero song. Uh, uh, but, you know, we get stuff like that. Um, but one thing I like about they still keep climbing deal from the con shop, you got have a last name, you know. And I'm hoping it literally is just deal from the con shop. You know, just like in the Mark Moonfront episode, Dick and Body Reggae Pain Point. Hey, my name, you know, what a good, it's Dick and Body Reggae Pain Point. But you know that, like, I'm hoping a similar joke. You got, you know, from the con shop, but you know that. Watch me, didn't know that, but whatever. Um, <laughs> well, I like that. Um, God, I, I quite like one, too. Again, it was a former event, you want, like, cultural form. Like, this one does something different. But again, it's two different. Go, it's Annika multiple story up go, and I love them. It's a lot of fun, very tough. Yeah, I watched both of them back to back. on time. Well, Vanish didn't feel like it. Um, and we've got, again, well, I can play, come, I almost couldn't show it to me. Good, but the story is funny, but it's like it's short, of, it's like it's over, but all we ever get some time to play out. Like, um, you know, Chandler Mark, one of them had the theory that, um, no, it was Chad. Um, he had the theory that Milo actually, actually ghost that do in front of all the bad thing, and Milo was he and ghost, and if the ghost were, and he is killing up the mess of a ghost. If we get things like that. I found Catching Gack, where he imagined Milo's life like an RPG, which is very creative. You know, uh, and then, go, oh, yeah, uh, those are the code and cannabis in this one. Go, they're able to go and up, go out, their stuff, which is good. So, yeah, we got, both of y'all can prove that you can do up, go, that don't rely on Phoenix Verb, or don't even rely on the ongoing story, okay, go, book one. I kind of wish we were to mean, like, we could both be, we could become particularly creative, because of the joke. We could talk with D.O.G., that was great. Um, yeah. Yeah, we got to go do a much better job. I don't know, we can really like the best that we can get enough kind of game night. Uh, because I think do the best job of showing what I want the show to be. You know, to still have a lot of similar type of humor in the but still have a different premise. And be able to A, do story where close to it formula, but do well, and do something different that don't think going to a show in, which I got to think a lot of Phineas did. Well, and again, without reminding too much, I just, it can't believe that hard. I hate game night club do can, you know? This doesn't. But I do wonder why. I think after the, the thing they do at the end of the day, I get they didn't want to. They bring him back right after the that. They aren't ready to do it yet. But, okay. We have no idea what the next one is. The whole deal right now, if they don't know, they didn't even to renew it. Um, They are currently at work at the latter half of season two. Or act like few up because you took we're not totally done making this yet and they're waiting on Disney they're waiting on the key how the first like batch that they air in January done. And I do fear I won't though would do well enough to warrant Disney wanting to make another key, especially if they just dump them and don't have time on it. The Conqueror will get advertised, but in January I think they should start on the marketing for that now. Uh so at least yeah, you know, but I hope they have time to get really, really well and end up doing well that we get for it. I don't want the DFT curve to hit again, where most of the cartoon only lasts in the end. But they catch me star because it's pretty popular, and Top Town because it got very popular, and I'll go and move to Ninja Channel where more people call it. <laughs> you know, but I hope the show comes with our catching, but I just kind of doubt it. You know, and that game would be popular, I mean, to the rating and to people talking about it. 
you know, and considering from the niche group of people who do watch you know, Fuji and the upload and stuff, and that re met reaction, I can't wait to get on when everyone gets to see him. I'll be going, but, um, but yeah, there we go, very in a, um, my world is very creative for that, because both of the episodes I really liked, um, they're, they go with game night, the one I really liked, and they're going to pretty good, you know, like, pick, make, wait, but, um, but yeah, it's been good, they could good one to come back with, um, I liked that kind of feeling on the preview pairing, because I think this one would be a really good pairing, if I view that, like, pairing of the pairing, because it's, like, two really good back-to-back, for good. So, yeah, quite enjoyable pair. It definitely might be how good the show can be when it's not throwing into. <laughs> I hate to be pessimistic because I don't mind how much a couple people do, but it's a little bit of an issue with me. But <laughs> Oh well, I have no idea. No idea what that type of could is or if it will gonna do. That corner is still 80 quid. Which reminds me, I haven't seen Cake Explosion. Go so that's one I haven't seen because I like sort of kind of an aired, but apparently aired in India, go, I don't know if we're getting a shiny for that one or not, if it does miraculously show before Cape Bloodshot air, I'll do that vlog, okay, that's the one I haven't seen, I have no idea how it is, I know Doom's working on that one though, <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll see you guys whenever the heck the next episode is back.